Friday morning at Holy Redeemer Catholic Parish in North Portland, parishioners and staffers get ready to board up the church. I'm quite concerned. You know, my family's been in this parish for over 100 years. Tom Mark Graff's concern stems from what's planned to happen at nearby Peninsula Park late Friday. Demonstrators plan to protest, condemning the United States Supreme Court and its decision to overturn Roe v. Wade. We as a church stand against the taking of an innocent life through abortion. That makes the Catholic Church, and in this case, Holy Redeemer, a prime target of those who see it a different way. We would love to sit down and talk. We'd love to dialogue. We'd love to have a respectful conversation and exchange of ideas. But that's unlikely. Judging from what we saw just last weekend, a nonprofit and several other businesses in Northeast Portland's Hollywood district were damaged by protesters. We're saddened that people take destruction as a means to express their opinion. Father Michael Belinsky says in hopes of deterring demonstrators, parishioners were planning to keep vigil at the church Friday night, but they've since been encouraged not to by both police and the archdiocese. This group has seemed to be very violent and intent on destruction and to use things that they can project or throw things that can cause harm. Father Belinsky is asking his parishioners and others in the community to stay home and pray the safeguards the church is putting in place work and protesters show mercy they haven't in the past. Well, I think it's just mayhem and I think that's what we're seeing throughout the city and uh, we've got to clamp down on it because it's just out of control.